Blake Richardson has sent me the eyeball man. It looks fantastic. Should I put this on the screen, Blake Richardson? Okay, Blake Richardson says you can share it if you want. So let's do that. Let's create an image. Okay. Yep. Behold. The eyeball man. Just minding his eyeball business. Really nice work, Blake. Really, really like it. Let's try to draw the likeness of this eyeball man, huh? Hmm. It's got really fallen arches, this eyeball man. He won't get drafted to the military. He should count himself lucky. So just like this, I guess. Looks like one of those minions, the way I draw it. Kind of like a leaner sort of a minion guy, huh? From the Despicable Me universe. But they have their own movie now. They have their own franchise. <laughs> yeah, Eyeball Man is getting fan art from Daddy Ko's Man. Like a yellow Among Us guy. I don't know, we can do some more variations on this. So I actually like this kind of more stand up straight look this original drawing had. So maybe rephrase it a little. Something like this. So maybe this foot has like elephantas, is, which is like really gnarly muscles and but then the other leg is kind of skinny and lanky. Don't forget his stripes. Nah, I'm taking artistic license. So these alcohol markers, they really start to look nice and lovely as their ink starts to... dry up. The Mugu says Peppa Binia. Yeah, this this thing just looks like a Mugu. Blake Richardson's Muguoids, I say. Let's throw some more here and then we can color them. God damn, it's running out. Hmm, okay, we can still save it with this edge. Let's see what I can do with it.
Now begins the great part. So after using the alcohol markers to draw the outlines, we just use some very flat, regular colors, nothing fancy, to kind of tone these guys. So we just add shades like so. In this case, this is to Blake Richardson's credit because we are doing fan art of his stuff. So now we are also using some dark neutral colors to just fill in the empty areas so these guys look more quote unquote vibrant. Yeah, special thanks to Blake Richardson for sending in this fun art and inspiring the rest of the process.